Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. I've missed you guys so much. Um, before I get started, let me just state that if you are new to my YouTube channel and you have not yet subscribed, please go ahead and subscribe at the very bottom. So we are here today, you guys, because I am going to be creating a look with this amazing Club Nebula palette. This is perfect. I've never had a palette like this yet. I won this from my friend Marissa's giveaway um, from one of her subscriber giveaways. It was packaged so like amazing. I never once won a palette like this like ever like so packaged well and the whole theme of it is just amazing. Um, I've never won anything from Kaleidos. So it's a uh, Kaleidos Club Nebula palette. Let me go ahead and open it up so I can show you guys what we're gonna be working with today. The, even like the little screen is so cute because it even has its name across and it it's like it's super thick too it's like really freaking thick so that's awesome these are all the shades we're, that come in the palette you guys so freaking amazing I think today you guys we're gonna be touching down on this shimmer a little bit of this a little bit of that who knows where we're gonna throw in maybe a little bit of this one too we're gonna throw it in just so we could go along with the theme of the shirt and the outfit today but um yeah you guys i cannot wait to uh show you guys what i create with this palette again thank you so much marissa for picking me um and gifting me this amazing palette um i am going to be doing the little tutorial uh sped up a little bit so um we're just gonna go ahead and start up this tutorial and let me know what you guys think um at the end i'll talk to you guys in a minute all right guys let's get started i'm gonna go ahead and get my long wear primer from hard candy and I put it all around my face and just blend it into my pores with my fingers. Like that. Then I'm gonna go ahead and grab my new eyebrow pomade from Presumida in the shade Ebony and just apply to my brows, shape them the way I want them to go and fill them in. And just like that, bam, it's already done. Not what I expected, so we're gonna go ahead with my e.l.f. concealer and clean it up a little bit with my brush. Since my concealer is a matte concealer, it does dry pretty fast, so I grabbed my beauty blender here to um, blend in the concealer, what I have on the bottom of my eyebrow so far. Then I want to go ahead with a concealer and clean up the top of my brow as well. And then I want to go ahead and grab a little brush as well and clean it up by blending out the concealer at the top. And just like that, both are done. Then I'm gonna go ahead and apply my concealer to my lids. And the very first color we're gonna pick from this palette is called, uh, I believe, Nero. We're gonna apply that to the lid, the upper lid of my eye. To both eyes. Then the very first color uh, we're gonna use on my crease is called Queen of Blades. Alrighty then, and then with another brush, we're going to go ahead and blend that Queen of Blades into the Nero to give it a good blend and a good shadow. Next, we're going to go in and use my concealer and we're going to cut the crease.
and both eyes are done. The second color we're going to pick for our lid is called Gravity. We're going to apply that to the inner corner of our lid and bring it towards the middle. It is so beautiful. I love this tone of green. Then we're going to go ahead and apply that nice baby blue color called Seven of Nine. And we'll apply that on the outer corner of our eyelid. And then we're going to grab that beautiful dark uh, blue color called Void and apply that on the outer corner and just blend it inward. Just like that. I absolutely love this shimmer. It's called Firefly. We're just going to use our finger and apply it over the gravity. Then with my very thin and fine uh, brush, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to grab Queen of Blades again and make a precise line shadow effect around the gravity color. We're going to do this to both eyelids. And just like that, we're going to go ahead and grab my LA Colors Black Liquid Eyeliner and create a wing on both sides. Here we go. Then I'm going to go ahead and grab my Maybelline Lash Sensational Mascara and apply that to my lashes. Just like that. And then I'm going to go ahead and grab my La Mexicana book and use the lashes called Hermosa and use my uh, duo clear eyelash glue and just apply it like that. And there we go. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and grab my foundation from Pharmacy. I'm in the shade uh, Vanilla and apply that to my face with my Beauty Blender. Then I'm going to use my concealer and apply it also on my face and use my beauty blender as well. Then I'm going to go ahead with my Doe Color Goth 6 Color Contour Palette and start contouring my face. And then I'm gonna go ahead and grab some setting powder to set the concealer so it doesn't crease or crack at all. And bam, all blended in great. Then I'm going to go ahead with my Amuse Professional Gilded Rose Palette and grab that beautiful rosy blush and apply a beautiful pinkness to my face. Then I'm going to go ahead with my finger and apply the Glisten uh, Highlighter to my cheekbones, my nose, and also on the very, very top of my lips. And then with my Kabuki brush, I'm going to go ahead and brush that in just a little bit. Then 
with uh, my brush, I'm going to go ahead and grab Queen of Blades again and apply it to the very bottom of my waterline. Then I'm going to go ahead and grab my eyeliner and apply that as well. Finally, my lip plumper, guys. Then I'm going to go ahead with the lippy that I chose. It's called Crystal. It's from the Let's Do Makeup and Life Glam collection. And then finally, I bought a new lip gloss from Beauty Shakers called Peach Me. So I'm going to apply that over my matte lippy. And I do believe that's it, you guys. I absolutely love it. What do you think? Hey, guys, and welcome back. Um, I just want to say this makeup look. Perfection. Um, thank you so much to Marissa, like I said, for the um, palette. The palette itself was absolutely stunning. I had told myself in the beginning of the video I was only going to do like two or three colors. I did like the whole row of colors on the top row. <laughs> I just had to. They were so beautiful. Um, these lashes too, though, you guys, um, are truly, truly amazing. I love how it came all together with the look. Um... Yeah, you guys, I will, um, right below in the description, um, all Marissa's information for Instagram and for YouTube, guys. So, please feel free to go follow her and go subscribe to her channel. It'll be in the description below. Um, all the products as well that I used today in this video are going to be listed below in the description as well. So, please feel free to go check out where I got them from. And, yeah, you guys, this stunning, stunning, stunning... Um, also, I would like to do a quick shout out for my friend Elizabeth. She is the lovely lady who created this mirror and the other three right there on my wall. Um, if you guys would love to be interested in getting a handmade mirror, please contact her. I will list below um, her two pages where you can contact her from. She also is the one who is responsible for um, me of me purchasing, actually. Uh, I purchased this pair of earrings and this necklace from her as well. As well along with many, many, many other earrings and um, necklaces as well from her. So guys, please feel free to go um, check her out, you guys. She's truly, truly amazing. Um, I, ab I absolutely adore her. Um, but guys, like I said before, if you guys are new to my channel, please feel free to subscribe to my channel. Click the little bell in the corner so you get notified every single time I post a new video up. And I think I'm back. <laughs> Bye! <laughs>